Hello everyone and welcome back to another die cache review. I almost said custom die cache review. That's not what this is. Uh, it's about to be though. I'm going to turn this into a custom. I don't remember uh, what race it was, but he has some tape and bare bone on the hood, so I do want to remake that. This is the Jockey 2022 edition. Uh, I'm a little late on this die cache review, if you couldn't tell. Uh, but yeah, so the Jockey car, Suarez had the car very, very, very identical, if not the exact same paint scheme. Uh, but of course it was 99 instead of the 1, so, uh, yeah, pretty interesting little car here, uh, very patriotic, I don't think this is ran anywhere patriotic-wise, but I mean, I could be completely wrong, not sure what Jockey is, other than that it's made in, Co made in America, made in America, I was thinking of, a collection, is that what this is, uh, I can't, I'm going to, we're going to have to take a look at that in a minute, uh, my eyes are not very good, apparently, so, yeah, the, uh, Jockey car, again, Suarez had the same car, I don't, know if it was made in the 164 i think so but i'm not 100 percent on that not only are we just talking about ross uh he's the most recent winner for the cup series which is a uh, pretty awesome uh second no first round no first race in the second uh round of the playoffs if i could think correctly uh too bad ross wasn't in it because he would have advanced it, well maybe depending on how the first round would have went uh but yeah so one in a pretty freaking awesome scheme, too. I might have to uh, pick up a couple just for some race wins. That way I can make some of the race cars early. I don't know if I want to or not because that's just kind of kind of dumb because Lionel will probably make it anyway. But nonetheless, we're going to get this die cast out of the box and take a closer look. Here's the die cast out of the box. And honestly, it looks a lot better than I thought it was in the box. Uh, it's kind of a weird paint scheme. I don't remember where it was ran. Uh, I know it was more than one race, I, at least I think so. Uh, but yeah, I got a red, white, and blue. Got all the American, American-ness you can probably fit into a, uh, a, a race car. Maybe you're, you might be missing a couple eagles and some of, and some of our uh, army vets. But, you know, either way, <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty awesome car. I love how part of it is like the, uh, the flag stars or like the 50 state stars. So if you turn it this way, it looks legit like the flag kind of thrown over the car. It looks very nice. Uh, Jockey, Chastain. Of course, you got it on the name banner there. Uh, Jockey and the number one on the roof. I'm going to back out a little bit there and brighten it up. Chastain on the rear name banner, of course. Got Jockey on the deck lid. Uh, Jockey.com, Made in America collection on the uh, the back in here. Got the taillights. We got the number one. Sorry, my uh, nails are dirty. I've been working on my car today. Uh, Camaro Z01, Worldwide Express, Simon's there, Jockey, Made in America Collection, uh, Advent Health, two winter stickers, Ross Chastain, of course you got your uh, Chevy Bowtie, Moose, and Advent Health, stripes all the way down the side, you got the blue number one, uh, of course you got your NASCAR Cup Series logo there, Goodyear, Goodyear Tires, of course you got your Sunoco, then you got your front end here, just, you know, your normal Camaro front end, very nice. Uh, oh, that one kind of doesn't line up very well, but that's okay. Uh, that's pretty much it. I don't really like how the jockey is taking a chunk out of the uh, Americanism of the car, but I mean, I get it. You know, you got to put your logo there somehow. Uh, but yeah, very cool car. Uh, back Throwback to when the uh, banners were super non-detailed. Well, not non-detailed, but the, uh, the Chevy bow ties were not colored in, so uh, there's a little throwback for you all. But as I said, this one will be a race version. I just got to figure out where it raced at because I knew there was a... I remember it seeing with or being seen with like your bare bond and damage and stuff. So if you couldn't tell, I really like making a uh, custom race version diecast. But with that being said, I do believe it will, that will be all for this diecast review. I almost said custom diecast review. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you in the next video no one will blow up your phone like me won't ever go on the phone like me hot damn i'm the man and you want to be just like me you will never be in a zone like me no one will blow up your phone like me won't ever go on the phone like me